one more thing. Don't touch that squirrel you thought was dead. It's not. <laughs> Here is Ray Romano's advice to his younger 20-something self. Don't be afraid when things get shitty, because they will, and it's going to suck, but that's okay. Just don't be afraid because if you keep moving, it always gets better. So I guess that's my advice. Allow the hurt, but not the fear, and keep moving. One more thing. Don't touch that squirrel you thought was dead. It's not. <laughs> Um, so if you've been living under a rock the last 10 to 15 years and you don't know who Ray Romano is, um, he is a award-winning actor and comedian who is famous for his role on the sitcom Everybody Loves Raymond. So he's a legend and um, I'm not totally sure about the squirrel bit, but uh, I'll have to ask him and get back to you. Um, but anyways, I love his advice because it's again something that highlights the importance of focusing on the journey and embracing the ups and downs. And a, a really cool piece of advice that I received was when I got down to Medellin, I, I was speaking with my buddies about kind of what my next steps were. Money was at the front of my mind trying to figure out how I would start generating money. And they said, look, don't worry about money. Ask yourself, what is the thing that you would do every single day of your life if you knew you wouldn't get paid for it? So. That was a very deep and insightful piece of advice that really has kind of added a lot of clarity uh, to, to my daily tasks and, and kind of trying to figure out my next steps. And I feel like that piece of advice is also very related to um, Ray's advice here. So how you can apply uh, Ray Romano's advice to your life right now is ask yourself that same question. What would you do every single day? if you knew that you wouldn't get paid for it. And then go ahead and do that thing. The reason that you want to ask yourself that question is because when you are serving a purpose that is higher than yourself and you're doing something that you absolutely love doing, you're able to persevere and keep pushing through the shitty parts, as Ray mentioned. 